when you have a meal, make sure it's worth remembering. And nothing is more impressive than our Pollo Monterey. Now on Cooking with Kooks. My name is Chef Jose Peel, the man with the black belt in cooking, and today I will prepare for you one of my creations, Pollo Monterey, a south of the border dish so popular at my old restaurant, they were sucking it up like a hungry vacuum cleaner. Chef, why don't you call it poultry instead of pollo? Grandpa, you know nothing about embellishing terms and titles for menus. We call it pollo because other languages sound exotic, and pollo is Spanish for chicken. I ain't met no chicken that spoke Spanish. Ooh. Neither am I, Grandpa. They don't speak. They are chickens. They go cluck, cluck, cluck like that. Cluck, 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 cluck. Well, you didn't notice any kind of German accent on them, did you? A German accent on a chicken? <laughs> Most chickens I met speak German or Dutch. Uh, some Hungarian, too. Uh, you just never noticed because I'm a wizard and I have this aura that can allow me to hear them when they talk. All right, Dr. Doolittle, you have an aura, whatever that means. What do the chickens say to you? I'm a wizard, not a linguist. I can tell they're speaking German or Dutch, though. Well, at least they are polite. What do the pigs say to you? Do they speak pig Latin? <laughs> pig Latin. <laughs> pigs are the only ones speaking Latin nowadays. Now, you can go to the farm and you can hear the pig go. Just remember, that's a romance language. <laughs> they walked up to me the other day on the farm and they called me Stoltis. Stoltis, what, what the heck is that? Ha! They called you stupid. Stultus means stupid. The pigs called you stupid. <laughs> <laughs> oh, was that right? Well, I didn't take it personal. Maybe they had a point. Enough with the irritating nonsense, Grandpa. Or I'll start using a language that is unsuitable for family entertainment. Pollo Monterey is a Southwest Mexican fusion dish. The recipe combines well-loved elements. Seasoned ground chicken is added to red beans, tomatoes and green chilies, chopped peppers, red onions, tomatillos, and cilantro. This is served over white rice. This is a simple dish perfect for weekly or daily enjoyment. Adjust the seasoning to your preference. Take two pounds of ground chicken and put it in a pan under medium heat. Chop with a spatula. Add the salted pepper. Add the chili powder. Then the smoked paprika. Add the garlic powder and onion powder. Then the cumin. Continue to chop with a spatula often and throughout the preparation. Add the minced garlic. Then the hot sauce. Add the lime juice. Pour in the pureed tomatillos and tomatoes and green chilies. The red onions come next. And don't forget the tri-colored chopped peppers. Lastly, the red beans. Give it a stir and cook for three minutes. The chopped cilantro comes at the end. This mixture is put on a bed of white rice topped with chopped scallions, Colby Jack cheese, and a lime twist. 
Ah, now here is the finished product. See, isn't that wonderful? Now, we taste. Mmm. Oh, that is good. I need a second helping. That is wonderful. It is spicy, it is tart, it is a medley of flavors. You will love this. Pollo Monterey. Well, that is all for today. Join us again right here, and it doesn't matter what the animals say, they are still delicious. I am Chef Jose Peel for Cooking with Cooks. Cooking with Cooks is a production of Culinary Characters of America.